It's the mindset. Free your mind. Free your mind. Mindset. Free your mind. Free your mind. Hey, not everything that glitter is gold. Not everything that's white is snow. On the mindset, I just start let them know, let them know, let them know. Words from the wise, I just star, we will never lie. Stand tall, we will never die, we'll forever shine. I just star, shine like the star in the sky. Some hate, some love. Blessed love, pleasant, good evening, good afternoon. One welcome, Mindset Program. I just stand your host and I want to greet you in the divine name of His Imperial Majesty. Emperor Yes Selassie I the first, Empress Men in the first. Yes I one more day above ground and you don't know sir we are give thanks and praise for that. Zin our ultimate position, not no greater than that, no matter what go on. Alright. Um beautiful viewers and subscribers, great for the item um on the platform here today. You don't know it's always a joy, you know what I mean, for sheer, you know. What we, you know, what we come across, and you know, the information, and knowledge, and experience, um, you know, that we have within um, the whole spectrum of life, Zin, and we give thanks that Rastafari is a part of our life, and Rastafari is our life. So we give thanks, and um, we give thanks to the world, people at large. You know what I mean? Yeah, man, give thanks to everyone where I always take the time off to tune in. You see me, I say, we give thanks to everyone that's been showing us love over the mass, um, the vast, um, the period of time, you know what I mean? Um, last couple of months, last couple of years, weeks, days, you know what I mean? Give thanks to the strength and the support, it means a lot, you know what I mean? Yeah, man, give thanks. So, um, today we have um we have um and yeah we have a, a article where we have a look on Zin regarding Rastafari and and locks in school and it's an article um that was um came out a few weeks ago or a couple of days ago I should say um in Barbados. Zin regarding the whole um, Rastafari community and um, religious organization, the different religious organization, um, what it means Zin to to have long long hair in school. You know what I mean? You gonna have to um, bring some form of letter showing that you are part of an organization that. Um, why your appearance is all the way it is, you know, meaning like, you know, your locks, for instance, you know, a Rasta man, a Rasta woman, Rasta youth, Rasta, you know, them, them have, have locks and, you know, it will be long some of the time. If it does start growing, it will be short. You see what I say? So, what the virgin name I said in a, um, Barbados is that you have to have um you have to have a written thing Zin, from someone in that organized that um religious organization because it's obvious that they're you know grouping Rasta as a religious organization in Barbados. Why they are saying that? Because them say they're gonna make a policy that um it facilitates for, for, for every group. Zin, Christian, Muslim, Sikh, you know, Rast, every, every religious group. Zin, that, um, that is on the island. The mother will come up with a policy. And what the Rastafari community um, concerns are, they, are they, they, they should be assured that um, it will be taken into account. So, that is what um, the must say in a Barbados. We have got in the, um, in the article itself. So 
ones can get a more understanding of what um, is being said. But based on what um, I'm seeing the, from, from the things, yeah, it's quite interesting. It's very quite interesting. And probably um, I'm going to come forward after and give my thoughts on um, the article itself. And the item also can leave your thoughts and comment within the comment section. So let me go into the article. And um, so school just code to be more inclusive for Rastafari and religious faiths. A member of the Rastafari, a member of the Rastafari community are being given the assurance that schools policies governing dress code will be reviewed in the coming months and their concern will be taken into account. The chief the chief education officer Dr. Romoara Archer Bradshaw gave a promise following the complaints from some parents that the Rastafarian children who had locks were being given a hard time by some principals and their return to face-to-face -face learning. We will take into account all concerns raised by persons of various faiths and we will develop a policy that is inclusive to all, she said. According to the National Rastafari Registry Secretary and Trust, NRRST, several parents have been requesting letters stating that their children are Rastafarian so they can be allowed to attend classes. However, the NRRST said this was tormented to colonial tendencies since the same was not done for other religious groups. In a statement to Barbados today, the organization said that one parent was upset and her was upset that her son was being questioned about the the about the principal about the principal repeating. I will get this straight. In a statement to Barbados today, the organization said that one parent was upset that her son was being questioned by the principal about his religion and being asked what tribe he belonged to. Wow. What tribe? I didn't know that. Um, Rastafari. Well, that's another thing again, because in Ethiopia, I think Rastafari, Rastafari community is seen as um, I think 130 something or 40 something tribe in, in Ethiopia. So I don't know if that's where they're coming from with that argument. But let's continue reading. The NRRST said while it did not have a problem with providing letters for the children to providing letters for the children so they could be allowed an education, it was not fair to Rastafari since other religious groups did not have to provide, um, prove their, their faith. Why do Rastas need a letter from a so-called authority in Rastafari say that some, someone is Rastafari? Do Christian need a letter from the priest to say that they are a Christian for their um, particular needs? They have, do Muslim have, a, do, do Muslim have to bring a letter to say that this child is Muslim from a Muslim family? Question mark. When the parents is telling the school, my child is a Muslim, my child is a Christian, my child is a Rastafari, parent has to go now somewhere else to a leader within the movement, 
which really and truly are only limiting Rastafari, content and, and, and organization, a uh, 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 non-denomination organ of Rastafari community whose main goal is to facilitate cooperation among, among Rastafari in Barbados. Saying it has received several messages from parents seeking a letter from what principals from various schools are calling the leader of a Rastafari tribe, NRRST, added, this, is it, this in itself speak to their ignorance of Rastafari because it is not a tribe or anything like that. The only leader within Rastafari is El Selassie. You may have a community. You may have, you may have community activists and elders, but really and truly, Rastafari, all true communal, is an individual tradition. So no one really can say who is Rasta and who is not Rasta. It is for the parents in that family. And that should be good enough for the school. Why do we have to go, go further out than that? The organization said there seems to be a fight against lax and that it is stink of colonialism and stink of um, Eurocentric standard of what is beautiful, what is tidy, and what is neat, and what is acceptable. However... Um, Archer, Bradford, Archer, Archer Bradshaw told the Barbados today that the policy has always been for boys to wear a simple low earcut or present a letter if they are entering the school for the first time with locks as part of their religion. All right. So, in this case, if the young man was converted to Rastafari field over the past two years, he should inform the school because, of course, it would be a deviation from the point of reference. If he is converted to Rastafari, he bring a letter stating such. And, of course, we allow those children to wear their ear long because they have the evidence to show they are part of the Rastafari faith, she explained. See what I want to say? See what I want to hear. And Archer Bradford said, since the resumption of classes late last month, it has been drawn to my, to, to her attention that some boys were attending School with extremely long hair because their hair grew during the two years. There were no, no in-person classes. The chief education officer made it clear that rules, that that the rules are very clear. To date, there has been no changes in that policies. So boys are expected to have their hair cut and re-entry to school. Of course, there are students who have feet that would allow them to wear their ear long. In that case, letters are required upon entry to school and they are required to cover their ear with a thumb. This is not a new policy. This is not a new policy. This is a policy that has been in place for some time now, she reiterated. However, Archer Bradford promised that a review of the school policy will be done as some point, at some point and the views of the Rastafarian community will take into consideration. We will review the entire policy in the near future we will take into account all the concerns raised by the person of various faiths and we will develop a policy that is inclusive 
to all. But as it stands right now, as today, the policy is that a boy should have a low ear cut unless for religious reason they have to wear the ear long, she said. And that is the end of that article. <laughs> It's like a part of but it's quite interesting. So last year I don't want to know the idea of views that are as it cause um yeah, you know, it 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 um she clearly outlined that they don't want a fraud. I beg your pardon. No, I don't go so far. I don't go so far. But um what am I say? Which what she actually said, all our people out there were weird acts and them them are not really rasta. See? So if them are not rasta or if them are rasta, which which if they're part of an organization, then they're supposed to have a letter stating that them is a part of this organization. What which if um if it's the Bobo Shanti, if it's the 12 tribe, if it's the EWF, if it's the Naya Bingi, if it's the art, whichever house of Rastafari it is, that is what she said. She said they're supposed to have a letter upon arrival saying um, they're of this Rastafari um, house and they're a Rasta. So, all right, they're a Rasta, so you are low. For real relax, we will not discriminate against you because of you being Rasta. But if you are not Rasta and you are come with a bogus thing, then I accept. I saw it look like to me. So people, the, the, the community now, the, or the organization which is the N, which is the N R R S T. Zin, which is the um, Rastafari um, community or some organization in Barbados that represent for um, the Rastafari, is um, say that them, them, them kind of have a problem with it, that the school not really like people with locks. And it kind of give that impression still because when I say if you're not Rasta, Zin, then he, he, he must have a shot back and side and or if you have a ball head and, and thing and you know what I mean? That is that is simply what the, the, the thing like it a outline. But if you use Rasta then you're exempt from that because them no say Rasta of locks. That is what they must say. Now. That is what they must say. So I don't know how it go but the parents are say is not for them to say who is Rasta from, who is not Rasta. Uh, you know what I mean? Because no Rasta again still not have locks too. As they say. You know what I mean? As they say. So, um, I don't know. But let me know your views and your thoughts because I must say it's quite interesting something that is happening in Barbados. Barbados I don't know. It's like they might try to tell them not discriminate against locks if you are Rastafari. But if you're not Rasta, then you have to, you know what I mean, have a shot back and side. That is what they must say. But I want to know your views, your thoughts, how the items say this thing, you know what I mean? Because I don't know. But we have left a little thing with the item um, who don't, um, I don't know. Who don't know, but who know, know, and who don't know, get to know. Zin, until, more love, more strength, Rastafari. <laughs>
idiot. I just, I just thought, thought the mindset. mindset. Smash, Smash that, that subscribe, subscribe button. button. See you on the next video. video. I, I just, just thought, thought the mindset. mindset.